Madison is playing with the pumpkins one last time before I throw them out. They're gonna go in the trash tomorrow. Halloween is over. We need to put out the Christmas decorations. He's gonna be so sad because he loves these pumpkins. So we are dealing with daylight savings time and trying to cope with the hour change. We um, went back an hour and so Grayson has not adjusted very well lately. Um, the other problem is he has a cold. He's got a pretty bad cough and a runny nose. So I'm sure, I mean, we go out all the time. I'm sure he just picked it up somewhere and unfortunately he has a cold. So I'm trying not to get it. I don't think that's gonna work. I think I'm gonna get it. And so yeah, he was up at 6 a.m. this morning and then he only took an hour nap. So, and yesterday he took a really short nap too. And yesterday was day one of daylight savings. So I don't know how much of it is daylight savings and how much of it is um, his cold, but um, thankfully it's not getting him down too much. He is pr in pretty good spirits. Look at this little dog on his booty. I love this outfit. Yeah, is that a scarecrow? So I'm gonna put away all the fall decorations this week and then I'm getting out the Christmas decorations because why not? You have quite the collection. He's got a, a stem of one of the pumpkins, a pine cone he found in the ground, uh, my decorative pumpkin and the scarecrow. You are Appa. Yeah, the pumpkin. We went on a walk earlier and Gray was sad because almost all the Halloween decorations are put away because um, it's the week after Halloween now mama. and so people are putting mama, away everything. Mama. Yeah, I'm Mama. So Gray's new thing da, is he likes... Da, 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 da. Yeah, Dada's not here. His new thing is he likes to give high fives. High five, Gray. High five. High five. <laughs> He's adorable. That's his new favorite thing. We've got Gray sporting his overalls with his ruffles, sitting on his ball toy, and wearing his hat. Hat. He is one stylish dude. Oh. Is that your monkey? As you can see, I still have not put away the Halloween decorations, so I need to get to that. You can see the pumpkins and the reflection of the uh, fireplace. Uh -oh. Yeah. Uh -oh. Grayson started standing, it was grunting, and so I told him, go poop on the potty. And so now he's sitting. <laughs> he's sitting, he was sitting on the potty. Uh. So, um, it's the next day. It's day three of daylight savings, and I thought it would get better, but it's, I feel like it's getting worse. Um, the main reason why I say it's getting worse is because uh, Gray did not take a nap today at all. So we went earlier today and we met my brother. Um, he's looking at some apartments and stuff. And it was like a half hour drive to where he was looking at apartments. And we left at like, we had to be there at 10, so we left at like 9.30. And Gray ended up falling asleep for like, it could not have been more than like 10 minutes that he was out. Um, and then he didn't sleep the rest of the time and then when it came to put him down for bed for a nap I put him down at his usual time of like 11 30 11 45 and he just laid in his crib and after a while I went up to go see what was going on and he had a poopy diaper he does not sleep when he has a poopy diaper which I don't blame him so I changed him rocked him a little bit and then put him back and he still did not take a nap so He's still got a cold and he's coughing and sneezing. And I'm starting to get the cold now. I knew I was gonna get it because he's been sneezing and coughing all over me. My throat is starting to hurt. So I've been taking Zycam as much as I can 
but I knew I was gonna get that cold. So yeah, I thought things would get better as the week went on, but today has probably been the worst day since he hasn't taken a nap. I don't know how that's gonna affect him the rest of the day. It's only 2.30, we have to make it to seven. So we'll see, but yeah, I didn't think daylight savings was gonna be this hard, and it is, it's really hard. So we're just playing with toys. He's been really loving his car lately, and I've been pushing him all around the house. It's cold outside, so um, we're spending more time indoors, which is tough. Oh, yep, there he goes, he wants me to push him. I'm gonna get in. So yep, this is my life now. I just push Grayson around and then he just decides at separate times when he wants to get out. So because Grayson didn't take a nap, I still have the Halloween decorations up, which I'm sure Grayson doesn't mind, but I'd like to get rid of them. I mean, put them in storage. Do you want it on? the pumpkin because it's a pumpkin and it's got these little ghosts on it and a cat and it also has a bat yeah so yeah it's been a hard day i haven't had gray skip a nap for months i mean he used to skip it all the time towards the end yes it goes towards the end of taking two naps ghost but i've never had him do it now so it's just tough you bet what is that a pumpkin yeah I put the bubble machine on and he doesn't like to, he just likes to watch it from afar. Go pop him! And look, Felix is trying to get in. No, Felix. Yay! Bubbles! Woohoo! Can you pop him? Go pop him! Go pop the bubbles! Go pop the bubbles, Gray. <laughs> so look at our backyard and all of the leaves that have fallen. There's still a lot more leaves to go though. So that's why we haven't raked them yet. But there's so many leaves. Usually, Anthony and I just once a year wait until all the leaves have fallen and then we rake them all up. And we put them in like a ton, like 10 different bags of leaves. So I never look forward to that because it takes a while and it's a lot of work and it's cold outside, but it has to be done. So we're just waiting on the, on the rest of the leaves to fall. There's still a ton of leaves though. What, Gray? Yeah. So yeah, so many leaves. But it's pretty. Maybe we'll rake them all up and let Gray jump in them. That would be fun. He's so talkative. Yes. Leaves. Still sick. 
but I'm hoping the cold air kind of helps a little. <coughs> Bless you, poor thing. So I put a coat on him because it was getting cold. But this is it with the pumpkins. Allison's pumpkin. The trash goes out tonight and I'm throwing all these away. So he's having one last hurrah with the pumpkins before they go in the trash. And I've told him they're going in the trash, but of course he doesn't know that. He doesn't know what that means. So he'll know tomorrow when we come out and there's no pumpkins. I'll still keep the scarecrow and the other pumpkin out for now till it gets closer to Christmas, but today is it. This is the last day of the pumpkins. It's kind of why I'm just letting him do whatever with them. Most of them don't have a top anymore. They're all caving in on themselves. It's time. We're just gonna say bye-bye to the pumpkins. Bye-bye. Yeah, bye-bye pumpkins. Halloween is over.